hi faves welcome back to my youtube channel in this video i'm going to be showing you how to make black soup also called marubo now let's get started i'm going to boil my meat first i'm going to add some salt some seasoning i'm going to add some cameroon pepper to this to give my meat that peppery kick then i'm going to add some onions and i will give this a good mix together Once this is thoroughly mixed, I will cover and allow this to boil. After some time, after this has released its juice, I would open it and add more water for it to properly cook. Then I would cover again for some time and allow it to boil. I will add my pomo at this moment and add a little bit of water so that I don't have to season my pomo differently or throw in bland pomo into my soup. So I'm just going to add a little bit of water and mix all of this together. Next, I'm going to prepare my palm nut extract. I like to use palm nut extract for this recipe other than using regular palm oil because I find it more flavorful. I'll cook my palm nut extract until it is soft and I will blend it in my mortar like so. I will pound and pound and pound on keep pounding until the shells fall off once i get something like this i realize that i have reached my goal and i would stop pounding once i already get something that looks like this all the shelves all the shells has fallen off and now they are ready to be extracted i'll add some hot water to this to take out that juice i feel like that won't be enough so i'm going to go in with more hot water because the water is hot i clearly cannot go in with my hand so i have to go in with a spoon and i would use this to mix it together to allow that juice to get into the liquid that's what i'm trying to achieve Once that is done, I'll transfer this to a sieve and I'll get the juice out of that place. Yeah, so I'm just going to transfer it into a sieve now to get the juice out. Yeah, after that, this is what I have. I feel like that won't suffice because some of those palm nut extract is still on that seed so i'm just going to go in with my hands and allow it to cool down a bit i'll add some normal temperature water and squeeze out the palm nuts for it to cool down yes once this has cooled down i know that i am done and this is my palm nut extract now let's move on to the leaves I'm going to be using some scent leaves for this. I'll be using some Uziza leaves, some curry leaves, some bitter leaves. I'll use some saint pepper, crayfish, orima, alligator pepper, ginger, lots of onions, and some water for the leaves to properly blend. I realized that the, this requires more water so I added more water to ensure a better movement of the leaves in my blender. 
okay once i get something like this this is the consistency that i am looking for i know that i'm ready to work with this and i'll just turn off the blender and get cooking i transfer the blend to my dry pot there is no nothing in that pot just a dry pot and um i'll add some water to rinse off the the leaves in the blender so nothing goes to waste i'll add some ogiri to this i like to add ogiri in my black soup then i'll go in with our palm nut extract i will also go in with some seasoning some salt for taste i'll mix all of these together nicely until they are well combined i feel like this soup needs more pr because it doesn't look too appealing but it is so so nice like it is good once that is well mixed i will cover it and allow it to boil for a while after a while i'll add my fishes to this i totally lost that clip please forgive me and i will try to incorporate the fish into the soup with my spatula like so i would incorporate the fish into the soup so that it can cook inside that soup i would cover this for like 20 to 25 minutes and after then i would open it and this is what i have i'll add my boiled meat and promo i give this a good mix together to allow everything to form a good relationship please if you are new to this channel don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more amazing content like this this was so so good i mean super good it tasted so nice everyone loved it my husband loved it yeah so after like 10 more minutes i would give this a good mix and honestly at this point our soup is ready but you know for the sake of serenity i will leave that beef and pomo to still like have some time to you know relate with the soup release their flavor release their vibe into that soup and you can use any swallow to eat this but I think that Eba is the best swallow that goes with this thing because you but in this video I'll be using some fufu I hope you try this recipe faves it is super super nice thank you for watching bye